welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I will be doing a little quick tutorial on how to contour and highlight your face so that you have them cheekbones that everybody will hate you for and that glow that everybody will want for themselves. So as before we get into this video, you already know what you got to do. Click on that subscribe button and click that bell so you get the notifications when I post new videos. So without any more time getting wasted, let's get into this video. Alright, so I've done my foundation, powder, lashes, brows, and eyes off camera. And so now we're going to get into the part where I contour my face. So I'm going to use the Studio Pro Contour Palette by BH. This is the powder contour. I don't cream contour because I'm combination oily and it ain't gonna stay on my face. So I do all of that. I do my foundation first, my eyes, and then I contour and blush and highlight last. So I'm again gonna take this palette, take my uh, tapered blush brush by uh, Bare Essentials. This is the older brush I have, but I like using it for contour. And I'm going to go into this shade right here and I'm just going to draw my brush and then I'm going to turn to the side so you can see I naturally have a little bit of shade right here so I go right above that and I take the contour shade and I brush down and then now I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. There's a difference between my actual face shade and then where I contoured. You want to create the purpose of contouring is to create shadow on your face, and highlight is to highlight what where the light naturally hits your face. So just remember when you're contouring, the purpose of contouring is to create shadow on your face to create the shape that you want so trust me with contouring you can change the entire shape of your face with how you do it so me personally I like my face shape I'm not trying to alter too much but I want my high cheekbones to stand out a little bit more so I personally only contour right here I don't go across my forehead and I don't go here because it's not really necessary for me. So I just contour right here to create a little, to give my face a, a little bit more angles to bounce, for the lights to bounce off of. So I've already contoured here. And so now I'm going to take the Classic Blush Palette by BH Cosmetics. And then I'm gonna take my number three blush brush and I'm going to go into, I'm gonna go into this shade right here. And I'm just going to swirl. I'm gonna put that on the apples of my cheek. And just kind of brush up a little bit. So obviously as I'm doing this, I'm going to be going over that contour a little bit, but that's okay because again, the whole purpose of makeup is to enhance what you already have and then in some instances create what you want without having to actually go and get surgeries done. You can do a lot of this with makeup. So still going on the apples of my cheek with my blush. And then kind of going back into the hairline. And 
Okay, all right, so now I'm going to highlight and I'm going to take my Spotlight Six Color Palette by BH Cosmetics and I'm going to go into the color Radiance right here. I'm going to take my number five brush from the bronze collection, kind of tap into it, and then you want to go on the top of your cheekbone and kind of swirl up. I like highlighting like this because it makes my high cheekbones pop. So again, I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. I'm going to swirl a little bit up, kind of going to the bottom portion of my temple. Now I'm going to go down my nose. Kind of highlight the bridge of my nose. Now, some people actually contour on the other side of this. Again, I don't feel it's necessary for me, but if you want to, you can just all you do is take that same shade you contoured with, take like a really skinny flat brush, and just kind of etch out around. The bridge of your nose to give your nose the appearance of it being smaller but again I don't do that because I don't feel it's really necessary so go back in a little bit so I'm gonna intensify that highlight because I like glowing I like to have a nice healthy warm glow go down my nose a little bit And there we go. So now off camera, I'm going to go put on my lipstick and I will be right back. Now, one final tip. If you go a little crazy with your contour as you're brushing it on, all you do is take a take your beauty sponge, take a little bit of your face powder and just kind of etch out where you went overboard. And then that's just going to cut your cheekbones even more. So again, just kind of going back in, clean it up where I feel I went a little too crazy. And then you do the same thing on the other side. So you're giving that illusion that you got some cut cheeks. Kind of going right there. And just kind of blend that out. And then sometimes if you cut too much, kind of go back in with that same contour brush. Fill out a little, a little bit more, and then just kind of clean that up a little bit, and then you're good to go. All right, guys. So hopefully you enjoyed that little quick tutorial on how to contour and highlight your face so that you can be glowing and have them cut cheeks that everybody will be envious of. So. Hopefully you enjoyed that and come back to my channel and watch some more of my videos. But before we go, you already know what needs to happen. You need to subscribe to my channel and click that bell so you get the notifications when I post new videos. So until next time, guys, deuces.